And we're back on Studio 90, extra time with Stuart Holden. <laughs> That's right. Uh, no back four quiz today. We decided to do some Stuart Holden fun facts. Fun facts. Fun facts. I'm fun. Yeah. <laughs> may, fun. <laughs> they may or may not be true. We don't know. But we thought they were fun, even if they weren't true. But you're going to tell us if they're true. Stuart Holden, fun fact number one. Is it true that you were once a promising professional video gamer? I've tried to delete this from my Wikipedia about 16 <laughs> times. But, uh, yeah, I had a, a tough time in high school with a knee, knee injury, yeah. and I was out for about eight months, and I got heavily involved in some, uh, some video gaming, and uh, I, was, I was pretty decent. <laughs> well, I mean, let me, let me read this to you. Before his professional sports career, he went by the alias Holden. That's not really an oh, alias, though. Very original. Yeah. <laughs> and he most famously played for Forsaken. I think that's the name of a team, probably, yeah, right? Texas team. Yeah. yeah, during his time with the team, he helped them to a second place finish at 2002 WCG qualifier. Don't know what that is. An eighth yeah. place at the CBL Summer 2003. This is the big part. Featuring a win over the Shagard led ZX. Yeah. He was probably. <laughs> Actually, that, the legend. WCG was for the Olympics of video gaming, and we got second place. If we'd won, I would have been an, a, a Olymp an Olympian. Olympian. I think I would have been in the history of the world, the first two-time <laughs> Olympian in a professional sport and as a professional video gamer, something I'm very happy I didn't accomplish. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, apparently your game was Counter-Strike. Yeah. What does it take to be a good Counter-Strike player? Um, good reflexes and, yeah. a, and a good brain, so right. I got both. All right, that helps you in soccer. <laughs> um, all right, fun fact number two for Stuart Holden. Uh, it seems to us here at, at Studio 90 that your hair has taken on somewhat a legendary status, not only amongst the fans, but amongst the team here. Uh-oh. And we've, ha we've actually um, been getting Twitter messages from a Twitter account called Stuart Holden's Hair. And, this, this, and apparently Stuart Holden's <laughs> Hair keeps asking us questions. And the, the question is always the same. He, he wants He's got to a mind of his own. Yeah. <laughs> Stuart Holden's hair wants to know what the other guys on the team think of him, meaning your hair. <laughs> so, in other words, one was, what does Landon think about me? Um, I'm sure he has a few opinions. Um, yeah, I think my hair's kind of become a bit of a, a trademark. And Don't get me wrong. I can't it change great, it, it now. It is great hair. Yeah, it's, yeah. I, how's it look in the camera? Pretty good. I've heard it looks good in HD, so that's all I'm worried about. How long does it take to do that before a game? Uh, two minutes, man. Yeah. It's just a little bit of a ruffle, and it just goes straight to its own... Uh, its own position. It knows where to go. <laughs> it's well trained. <laughs> it's well trained. It's well trained. <laughs> All right. Last fun fact uh, for Stuart Holden. Um, as we talked about before, you, you, that Scottish accent still comes out of you. Yeah. Uh, um, I. Yeah, I. It's I, deep. I, it's I. deep in you. So we thought maybe we would have you audition for the part of William Wallace from Braveheart, okay. and see uh, see what our cast and crew here uh, thinks if you would have actually got the part if Mel Gibson. I've always I'd wanted to be an it. actor, so this will be a good test for something I'm going to do post-soccer. I like so. it. All right, let's, let's do it. Stuart Holden auditioning for Braveheart. Okay. Stuart, thank you so much for being here today. It's okay. But by the way, you guys had Mandy Moore in here before. She's an angel of all angels. Um, okay, well, yeah, let's, let's just jump right in. Uh, I'm going to have you first slate for camera, okay. and then you can start whenever you're ready. Rolling. Speeding? I have heard. Kills men by the hundreds. And if he were here, he'd consume the English with fireballs from his eyes and bolts of lightning from his arse. Just one chance to come back here and tell our enemies that they may take our lives, but they will never take our freedom! Stuart Holden, Braveheart! Braveheart 2, you will be seeing Stuart Holden. Yes. Me and Instead William of Mel Wallace. Gibson. He'll get the same uh, pay as well. Uh, before we get out of here, we're going to have you blow the, uh, or sign, the Studio 90 Vuvuzela. Sweet. And we're going to have you blow it. We heard you're one of the best on the team. I'm glad I'm so far down the list here. We're saving the best for middle. There we go. Yeah. Science. Here we go. Stuart Holden is going to take us home with his blowing of the Vuvuzela. I'm going to sing Sweet Home Alabama. <laughs> Professional, well done. Stuart Holden, Studio 90 Extra Time. We'll see you tomorrow.